body count lottery rounded out to a solid and sturdy 30. 10 out of Haywood. Thanks to unabated gang wars. One officer down, so I guess you're all screwed. Cause the NCPD will not let that go. Got another blackout in Santo Domingo. Netrunners are at it again, poking holes in the power grid. While over in Westbrook, trauma teams scraping cyber psycho victims off the pavement. And in Pacifica, well, Pacifica is still Pacifica. This has been your man, Stan. Join me for another day in our city of dreams. Hello and Welcome everybody back to Cyberpunk 2077 Last time we met the Red Taken Johnny Silverhand aka Kendall Leaves Welcome back. My guest tonight is Lieutenant Sarah Kokoski, spokeswoman for the NCPD. Hi there. Welcome to the show. Uh, hello, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. I hope you made it to the studio without any issues. No carjackings or drive-bys along the way? <laughs> no, no. Uh, fortunately, the streets of Night City are getting safer every day. We've seen recorded homicides drop from 7,103 a year ago to just... Uh, hold on, hold on. The streets are safe, you say, but what about the highways? <sighs> I'm, I'm sorry? You heard about the shooting off the Route 1 exit, I trust. Half an hour before any response team arrived on the scene. Over 700... Let's go. The Night City! And we have some level up points. Meet with Takemura. Mayor Lucius Ryan has passed away. We learned of Mayor Ryan's death from his family. He died peacefully in his sleep. The exact cause of his death has not been released. But initial reports suggest coronary implant failure. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be fulfilled by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced plans to run for mayor in the upcoming election. Today, we all mourn the untimely loss of our mayor and dear friend, Lucius Ryan. But when we've dried our tears, we must look to the future. To the future, Lucius envisioned from our world. Bruce finished him off too quick. Better stretch it out over two more rounds at least. That actually reminds me, I actually have to because it has been so quite some time I need to check my loadout. So I'm the bad guy? I'm not the one who's holed up playing the attention whore. He lost a friend. Can you blame him? He 
He's not the first or the last. It's called life. What's going on? Hey, what's going on? I live right upstairs. So keep on living. And stop minding other people's biz. Mendez, hold on. It's his neighbor. Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. Struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, Petrova. Barry's got nerves of steel. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez! Could you check on him when he's chilled down? Shit. Sure, why not? It's not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Just be patient. Cops falling in rough times can be touchy. Let's see what I can do. Hey, Barry. Everything all right in there? A few hours. Captain Caliente. Oh, that's what's in that. Welcome to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan, and this is the latest from around the world. The Lunarinskaya uranium mine collapse that occurred just outside Novosibirsk in southern Siberia has concluded with a happy ending. As you recall, there is happy ending in my city. Deep underground. Ah, my car. Let me get in and. What the hell happened? Looks like everyone in this fucking town's out to end you. Makes me feel like an amateur. A hack. Ugh, shut up. Gotta find out why Night City's most courteous is upgraded to hit and runs. Probably couldn't stand you anymore either. I said, shut up. My car. Yes, tell me. Please accept our sincere apology regarding the traffic in seat number 77111110096. The Delamine Corporation cordially invites you to its main headquarters in order to access damages and knowledge composition. Yeah. 
This is heavy vehicle. Ah, much better. <laughs> Okay, Colos was the... B? Yeah? It's been a long time. Wakako Okada, the lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well. You and that friend of yours. Until then... I apologize. Hmm? Heard you're home. Already. Sure got that ear to the ground. Siempre. Anyway. You need something. You know where to find me. Don't tell me that's a Jin Kuchi dress. Would you rather I lie? My lawyer's gonna go data crash on your ass. You hear me? No. He'll run you out of biz. Would you be so kind as to give me your lawyer's contact information? Fuck you, Cirque Brain! Thank you. Processing data now. <laughs> uh... Hey, Del. Hello, sir or madam. How can I be of hey, service? Hey, hey! He was asked in well, now I'm in front. That a problem? Uh, no, no. It's fine. What's got into you, Del? Don't recognize me? You sent me a message saying I should come in about the accident. You are currently speaking to a Delamay network subroutine. Alas, my operational capabilities are limited. Could you please clearly recite your incident report? Don't give him any numbers. That's how they find you. Who? Corpse. Uh, 77 0 Incident report 
for final. Confirmed. 96 at the end. It's a public enemy. Government target. Your identity has been established. Mr. Hans Jonas, what phrase would best describe your experience of incident number 7711110110? Actually a little heartbroken about my damaged ride, but I'd rather talk to the real Delamine if I can. V, my apologies if the receptionist was a bother. I'm preoccupied with the crisis that is ongoing, and I simply cannot oversee everything. I've taken the liberty of transferring a settlement to your account to compensate for the damage done. Ah, special treatment. Would you mind if we spoke elsewhere? Yeah. Sure. Let's talk. Then please follow the drone. Oh, that drone is so cute. I'm fully aware customer service is less than satisfactory at the moment. Perhaps a guided tour will prove some form of compensation. This corridor links the shop to the office. And here is where the magic happens. The shop is fully automated. I'm pondering broadening my portfolio to include repair services. Alas, the shop is currently overwhelmed with work. Think I know why. I'm still looking into the cause of the Delamay network vehicle failures. My working hypothesis is an advanced virus. I must resolve the situation quickly. This sudden rise in incidents is proving costly. Aside from drawing unwanted attention to the company. The control room. I feel honored to have you here. Rather, surprisingly. Control rooms are for Ganics. What good is it to you? There was a time this facility was human operated. I simply inherited their infrastructure. All these lights, what are they for? That's what I wish to discuss with you. A green light denotes a vehicle with which I am in contact. As you can see, that is no longer the case for some vehicles. Those are the red lights. Repair drones can't take care of this? This time, I fear, human intervention is required. Mm. I'm aware you offer a broad range of services and are unusually discreet. Thus, I'd like you to assist me in recovering my missing vehicles. Why is discretion a concern? Unnoticed, unbothered, right? In my case, broadly tolerated. Yet a marked increase in inspections suggests the authorities have begun monitoring me. Talking NCPD or Netwatch? The latter. My legal status does not fit neatly within current regulations. If I'm not careful, I could easily be categorized as an illegal immigrant. What? Okay, sure. I'll go after you missing wheels. I'm pleased to hear it. I shall send you the coordinates of their last known locations. You must simply deactivate each. I'll then re-establish the link and return them to my garage. See what I can do. Delamain vehicles are exceptionally secure. Be sure to have a scanner with decryption capability on your person. Scanner. Morning. Evening. Thank you. Hello. Processing data now. Please wait. I am just doing all these side quests. What is this? Point nine. Royal Blue Radio, broadcasting live from the heart of Corpo Plaza.
cocksucking suits. Fuck you looking at? Nothing to see here. Move along. What's going on here? This your first day in Night City? What's it fucking look like? Get out of here, pissant! Leave him alone. See this badge? That means I can do whatever the fuck I want. God gun on it. He's wounded! Copy that! Oops. Hello, Epoxy. Yes. I'm at like a police moment. <laughs> I was just trying to help. At least it spawns me here. But hello, how are you doing? Why do I sound like a Kremlin? Because we all know that all Kremlins are Finnish. So I am very much Kremlin descent. Okay, I am not doing that. Okay, don't do that. And then we have some ability points. Was here anything? that I need. That is actually good. Bolt. Only affects tech weapons. Everything went to tech. Yes, the whole are indeed Norwegian. And gargoyles are from Sweden. Hello? 
for science. I don't know what I was expecting. I actually don't know what the fuss is about. There were no booba in there. Where's your cute little egg? Got something that'll keep you hard for hours. Hey, you're looking... Ever sharp and snazzy, Josh. <laughs> I'll best believe it. You gotta represent, right? No, but Hello. you fuck for real. Why are you always so dressed up? Well, well. Who do I spy but V? In my humble parlor, no less. Bukako. Long time no see. So what brings you here? Willing to bet nobody knows Westbrook like you do. My husband's knew Westbrook, yes. Each of them, very high in the tiger claws, ruled Japan town. What did they do? They did what made the best eddies. Gave them the most pull, sold sex and black market tech. How many husbands did you have again? I can't help asking. How many of those husbands did you have? Five. All went before the time. Terrible family tragedy. You're not afraid that tragedy will strike you? Have to live somehow. For my nine sons. We have some outstanding biz to settle. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a Ripper Doc. They'll weave you a dermal imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A tiger class specialty. Thank you. Smart gun. Hello. Yo, yo, ever try rainbow poppers? Purple haze? Got every color under the sun, I do. By the way, that reminds me. Not that one. Paid in full. I actually can do this now. But no. Let's collect the uh, reward. For some reason, I didn't realize it was the radio.
the collider. How's Biz treating you, Cassius? Lately? Can't complain. MaxTac raided a black clinic not long past. Since then, custom accounts gone up, and so my prices. Coincidence? <laughs> you decide. Let me see what you have. Let's see what's good. Take your pick. Double jump, that is actually good. Ooh, 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 great hits. Please, I'm a look of a light. Units per second. When you neutralize an enemy, that is good with group battles in long run. That actually is. Mantis plates, toxic mantis plates. Ooh, electrify mantis plates, but I want to the poison. I want the poison. I want the poison. Gorilla arms. But didn't they supposed to have a sleepy? No, what? Wait, what was it? It was about this one. You need to use your smart target in smart weapons. Collect this system. Sande Vistan Zetatekilta Dino Hall Sande Vistan D 
device quick hacks. But does this thing take away the quick hacks? Doomsayer. Mm. Mm. Maybe something skeleton like. Yep, I think that's one. Oh, that's what upgrade to tier two. So these are upgradable. Nervous system. Senses. And I am just in my limit. Thank you.
It's with Takemura. No, I am doing something else first. There is mysterious. We have to go talk to her in some point. We to offer my condolences. Mm. Offer your condolences. Ay, Jesus Christo, v. You lived under our roof. Have the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. I was going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyote Cojon. Many of his friends will be there. Say no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. I did not doubt it for a second. Ahí te veo, Vi. Sanke vista. Nice.
<laughs> Don't miss with the samurai. Ha ho ha 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 ha. And then Both of us. I put this one. It looks like he's not the only one but the other dog in this story. Where the butt is in the floor? Where the butt is in the floor? I am now going to pay my debts. Huh. You, you rise and fucked up, man. Huh. <laughs> Rough night. Rough night. Oh, this is little China chew. It's too loud for you. You're slotting some meal plugs and it's nighty night. It's not bad. How you all been? I had just a little bit of cleaning because there is is it renovation? And today is Sunday, so I am planning to play this a little bit. Now the important thing.
Where's the cat? Where's the cat? Shakisa. Where's the cat? I want to pet the cat. How's Biz going? Uh, can't complain. Corpos learned to keep their distance, and Sokka's back hiring lone mercs. They all gotta have the newest, shiniest implants. Good thing you got Misty here to help. Handles your griping well. Yeah, renting out her shop's the best decision I ever made. You know what? Seems like you're the only person in Night City who's happy with this lot. You get to a certain age, you drop all your illusions. Life just gets easier from there. I finally scrounged up enough eddies to pay you back in full. Hold on to them just in case. You need them more than me. I'm not taking them all the way to my grave, Vic. Here. And thanks again for doing so much work on me without ever seeing it any. That's what friends are for. Mama Wells is next. Keep busy while you wait for the car to be repaired. Just next. And again, where is the cat? Did I actually miss the cat? Is the cat somewhere very obvious? You want the Honey. What is beef for honey? For some reason now my pen has blank. With Mama Bells. Oh. Ah, uh, I am idiot. No, this is Misty's. How's biz, Misty? Boomin'? Hmm. You're the first person to walk in here for two days. And two days ago, it was a pizza guy. Got lost. People in this town, they've lost their spiritual connection. But well, you know, I'm here to serve them, not the other way around. It is meat, pasta, and tomato sauce. Hmm. So there is no bees in it. Hmm. And for some reason, for a moment. But what they don't know, the real name for the thing they call cyberspace is actually. Jackie gave you these cards, right? I remember when he asked me to help him pick the right deck. I was thinking mm -hmm. Cine. He picked just the thing for me, too. I feel a real connection to for this deck. For some reason, I don't know why. We could lay out a spread for you now, if you like. The real name for the yeah. Why the hell not? Focus on the recent... The Fool. That would be you. Great. Thanks. Pitch. The Fool symbolizes the beginning of a journey. You brim with enthusiasm, yet remain unaware of both your capabilities and the threats you face. The Wheel of Fortune. The danger is greater than you think. It will come suddenly, without warning. Conflict is unavoidable. 
The reversed chariot reveals that such danger is tied to your love of risk. Do not aim too high, V. The magician. Interesting. You may meet someone fascinating. Someone charismatic. Maybe even someone you'll grow to love? It's hard to say. Thank you. Pandemonium! What are you... Check what out? is life without its body? What are the beings of the net if not souls from beyond our plane of existence? I have heard their voices. Let they who yet live never cross that threshold, for their souls... This is Night City. No one's got a soul to lose. Mock as you will, unbeliever! You shall see who laughs last as you're engulfed. In Hellfire. Satan himself! Laughs? See, now I'm skeptical. I heard the runner who wrote that Satan demon gave him a weak sense of humor. You ask! Who opened these unholy gates of the Abyss? No one's asking. And I answer <laughs> you! The Techno-Necromancers of Alpha Centauri! I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? You do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. I saw a disciple of truth in you from the very beginning. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen. If I was game developer, I will probably make it secret ending that opens only if you give him the maximum amount of donation. And everything after that doesn't matter. Like, you burn the city to the ground, that happens, or you save the city, whatever happens, but in the end, there is a scene that you come to the belief, or see the light. What was that? Oh, I remember this bug. If you start shooting, he starts to run. <laughs> Can we please stop talking about work? What happens going out and drinking to get, huh? What was the purple again? Oh, metal. I have never been in metal in Night City. How can I? There. was reported slain on the premises of the Konpeki Plaza corporate hotel while attending a family gathering. Saburo Arasaka's son, Yarinobu Arasaka, has cast three... I actually want to test the metal out. While we are here, do I have the money? Right, metal. Memory park, Celeste building, so it is Pacifica. I 
Maybe that one? I don't know where I am going, but I am still... Sweden has responded with force, sinking over a dozen refugee vessels in recent weeks. Despite humanitarian efforts... Know what the worst thing is about this place? Have we found heaven on Earth? Hello? We want to report... The crowds? No. The fucking smell. Us, of course. Two times. Last Friday. And tomorrow True. at three. Sweet oh, they replaced us with an android, so nobody noticed. Shum, you could boil shit in piss, and it still smelled better than this fucking dog. We will tell you who. Fairies. You can't hurt them. They're bad to the bone. You don't know me, but you will. Name's Dino. Deal with downtown city center. V. Yeah, I know. Heard about you. Odd stuff. Need anything, you call me. Remember, Dino knows everybody. Oh. I can sell something there. This is actually handy. Okay, this I have equipped two point one. Oh, it shows there. Okay, never mind. Damage per hit. No, that was. Attack speed for that. Bleh. Sell that one. Sell that one. Sell that one. I will keep that machete and change it up a bit. Mods. It has mods. Four times over time. Ah, yeah. That mod. Okay. No! What is the way? Oh, it is a very long walk. Can I go here?
any way to get up like stairs let's break the load I haven't been there yet, apparently. Yep. So! About that car! They own it. I don't have enough strength to hijack a car. Ooh, fishies. I'm walking here. Wait, what is my... By the way... Are you what? I'll take your car. Introductions necessary. I already took care of that. Someone comes to me with beers, I take care of it. Remember. I I can. While we're at it, need fresh wheels, mics. I got it all. Real good price. So hit me up anytime. Here. Now I can apparently buy beers. One another thing, if you wanna come size me up, look me in the eye, whatever. Swim by, I'm here. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't curious to meet you. Hey, 
Salud. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Hanging in there somehow. Somehow. You could have come over for dinner. Nuestra casa es tu casa. Hmm. But okay. We put it behind us. Hmm? I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. Could help you with that. Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. An ofrenda? What's that exactly? Friends and family. We gather to celebrate the departed. Our memories of them. And we bring things they loved in life and might need in the after. Sure some beer would be at the top of Jackie's list. <laughs> and there will be beer. I want to take part in the ceremony, but... I want to do it the right way. In line with tradition. Mm -hmm. But something I'd lay by his casket... that would do justice to his memory... I, I don't got anything. Mm. But your heart is in the right place, mi niño. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. You won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mijo. He's gone, and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. Ahí te veo. You here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes, too. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just, well... human. I guess. You know each other long? Half our lives. Grew up in the same streets. Saw each other a lot, but just never got together. Till a year back. Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. <laughs> Maybe. But that's what he meant. 
I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. What did you see in him? Let me tell you what he told me once. Told me he'd take a bullet for me. In an instant. Even if it'd kill him. Spoken like a true Haywood boy. A man. With dreams. Ambitions. Only thing they cost him was his life. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set. What, you, you two didn't get that far? He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. You mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon? No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie would want you here. That's more important. Come on. Looks like he swapped out the exhaust pipe. What? I advised him to do it. Right before the job. Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles. They don't print them anymore. That's definitely why they're up there. Yeah. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? ¿Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? Basketball signed by Dante Gonzalez. He was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie. Mm-hmm. They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC Blackouts now. Gotta be hanging here since 2020. Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems, and never give you gonk advice. Locked. I wonder what's in there. That's his lair. Slept there. He must have had a different key. Let's look around. Might be tucked away somewhere? There's a key. Found it. For whom the bell tolls, Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times. Always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. Have you read it? Is it any good? I... <laughs> I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ofrenda, though. story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. 
A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's beautiful. It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. An aquarium. It used to be tacos. And taco was... Miss Fish. A dwarf shark. Like, Minnie. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. Nice still. It's gotta be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentino's, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. But he didn't exactly inspire belt. any fond memories. Sort of a memento. His dad's. He used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it. Until one day, Jackie fought back. Kicked his butt. Told him he'd kill him next time. Old man was hospitalized, and then he left. Why'd he hold on to it? In case his dad ever comes back. Jackie's favorite tequila. Oh, still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. What? The founder of Sanson Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. Well, how'd Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him De Abajo had stolen her recipe. Victor Dix. I was for you and V. He heard about you. Remember you all too well, even. He'll wanna meet with V, but I think it'll just be a formality. See you at the afterlife. This was before the geek. Jack, pure and simple. Well, you got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. There ain't the air, no. Thank you. 
Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. I understand. Take care of yourself, Misty. Yeah. You too, V. Hey. Everything okay? Yeah. I just need some time, you know? a glass to him, Padre. A few glasses. De acuerdo. V, it's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Hey, V. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a, like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, no te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying, make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true, Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, ol, honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh... I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. 
I'd been hired to drive him and some contraband across the border. He bought some goods clipped from Arasaka. Top secret. Priceless. <laughs> A lizard. And, uh... I'll remember what he said then. That I came from a place where everyone's family. So he must be too. Jackie Wells. Always hungry for more. And never gave up. Not once. Once he set his mind to something. He was ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Broder, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life without hesitation. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. Hard on his sleeve, he didn't overthink things. He just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof. And, and that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. And if he's watching, I bet just about now, he's flipping them all the bird. When you go to war as a boy, you have a great illusion of immortality. Other people get killed, not you. Then, when you are badly wounded the first time, you lose that illusion. Rest easy, Chu. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful ofrenda we gave him. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. You... you sure? Jackie would kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, B. Talk to Padre. But first, let's sit. <sighs> it uh, sucks to meet like this, up. huh? Says he feels like he lost one of his own. Farewells aren't that bad, bad once you get used again. to them. Yeah. Hey, you? Gotten used to them. Eh? When you get to my age, friends don't come and go. They just mostly go. Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. Well, uh, I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Here to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. Jackie, uh, do you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. 
How are things in the streets? This is not the place to conduct business. Have some respect. So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us? From up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it. I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. Lupe's been handling the loss pretty good. She's hey, you! Woman. Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? All right, why not? To Wells! May he rest in peace. How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible Book Club. I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. I think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. From me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. Good for now, thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. All right, give me a break. All right, let's go. Pour you another for Jaquito. Listening's a skill, you know. Need you to focus now, okay? Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar in his favorite spot where he always used to sit. Poor. For Jackie. Amen, brother. I'll have another. Have as many as you want.
Let's try going to Putney! What's an open up? Before you can up against Kapuki, one sport is a scam and come and see are you box is the sixth straight can a real piece of shit. She's a fist like fucking hammers, animal club, rhino, woman's a legend. There's everyone fell at that. Not my problem. Okay. Welcome to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan, and this is the latest from around the world. The Lunar Ring Sky uranium mine collapse that occurred just outside Nova Sibiris in southern Siberia has concluded with a happy ending. As you recall, 35 miners became trapped deep underground following a high magnitude earthquake. But thanks to their Suze Lake 2 hibernation implants, the miners were able to survive without access to food and fresh water for two weeks. Two weeks? Remembering that right? 
Who is it? V, your neighbor from upstairs. Remember me? Talked about Prem rides. Back then you were pumped about the Mizutani Shion. I said it was for flash posers. <laughs> you don't forget a gunk thing like that. You gave me this look. I was about to hightail it to the Badlands right then and there. I remember. What do you want? You can't let yourself fall apart, Barry. Not here. Not in Night City. You're a badge. Ex-badge, but still. You gotta stay strong. I mean, if you won't, who will? Now, hold on a sec. We barely know each other, and you just rock up here talking to me about my problems. Where'd you get the idea something with me was up? You watching me? Someone send you? All right, you got me. Your friends asked me to drop in on you, so I thought, hey, why not? He's a stand-up guy. Who cares if he has shitty taste when it comes to street traders? Come back just to get your ass kicked? Man, you really know how to cheer a guy up. Maybe those two asshats really are worried about me. Well, all right then. Come on in. Not like you'll change anything. Hey, you never know. I lost someone close to me too. A damn good friend. What do you mean, too? Wait. It's about Andrew. He, uh, told you about him. Best bud I ever had. Known in my whole life. Only person I could spill to without being judged. I'm guessing things at the NCPD haven't changed a lick, huh? One time, a Maelstrom ganger killed a young kid right in front of my eyes. For shits and giggles. I couldn't do shit. The son of a bitch had corporal protection. <sighs> Typical. Our chief greases his palms with an anonymous donation. And guess what? Officially, kid blew his own brains out. Right in front of your eyes. Something died in me then. I couldn't do it anymore. A few months later, Andrew passed and... Everything went to shit. You didn't have anyone to unload on at work? How about Petrova and Mendez? Yeah, Petrova's a decent gal, but she's not good with this stuff. Mendez just doesn't get it. He thinks us blues need to be tough. Can't bear the sight of a kid getting murdered. Born with pussy genes. According to him. Well, you told him about Andrew. Honestly, I thought about it a lot. Anyway, they don't know everything. Better that way. Can you tell me how Andrew died? Does it matter? Normally, from old age. It's no wonder, seeing as he was only a few years younger than my grandma. Dying of old age? In Night City? That merits a monument. The whole world should gaze up at it in awe. <laughs> Ashbox and the niche will have to do. So then Andrew is more like a grandpa to you than a friend? Hmm. Wouldn't go that far. He was like a... I don't know. A window into the past or something. He reminded me of my gram-grams. About our little talks. Time when everything had its proper place. You know? He was the last living record of those times. Mendez doesn't know shit about life. Everyone's got their limits, even him. He just hasn't reached them. Not like you. What if he's right, though? Maybe my genes are soft. Don't only the strongest survive. If he felt nothing, that means his loss wouldn't have had any meaning. I guess so. Thanks for the talk, V. I am... Um... I need time to take all this in. Sure thing. Take care.
I actually was waiting for something to happen, but I didn't hurt anything. That is actually handy. You can just push the button and it summons the last vehicle you used. Kinda can, but not close enough. Wait. Yes. I remember this. One of my missing vehicles might very well be near where you are now. Thanks. Try to find it.
columbarium. Hello, Johnny boy. A tortoise? Is this some kind of joke? I don't know about you, but Barry didn't seem like the kind of pig to crack jokes. But a tortoise? <laughs> it makes no sense, Johnny. Barry said he was the only person he could spill his guts to. That not a good enough reason to buy a niche in a wall? Pay a visit from time to time? You're right. I sound like an asshole. Guy's depressed as shit. Only friends he had wouldn't listen. What the fuck else is he supposed to do? Picture this. You've got no one. Beloved granny's been in the ground for years. Only thing she's left behind is a dumb fucking tortoise. But when Grandma told you about life, that tortoise was there. When that same life kicked you in the nads, when poor Grams croaked, it was right there. Imagine how alone you've got to be to buy a niche for a goddamn animal. Barry's not okay. I mean, if that tortoise was the one thing that got him up in the morning. Now you're starting to get it. His friends have to know. Hopefully it's not too late. You know how it goes. Stare too long into the abyss, the abyss will stare right back at you. Taking a step into it wouldn't be so drastic, considering the shit he's seen in his lifetime. In loving memory of my best friend, Andrew, you were a tortoise, but you listened like a person. You were with me when Clammy explained what was right. You are the last memory of a better world. Rest in peace. to get his shit together. Don't cry out loud, Mendez. Hey, so what did Barry tell you exactly about that friend he lost? Not much. Hardly ever spoke about him. Said once he was the only one who could understand him. It's nice to have someone like that. We had a little chat. He seems chilled, but seriously down in the dumps. He's got a bone to pick with Mendez. What? So why doesn't he say so to my face? Clearly he couldn't stand his job and didn't have anyone to talk to about it. He said you didn't even try to understand him. See? Was I right? Uh, give me a break. Barry likes playing the drama queen. You just gotta shake some sense into him, trust me. We'll see. We'll have to check in on him later. Thanks for your help. This is for your trouble. The 
are attacking the Bay in a few hours. I have to say, this is actually dangerous. Just saying. Just saying. Something you only have power machine, power weapons. Okay, Take with mode. Gun owner, I hope. biggest story, the murder of Arasaka Corporation CEO Saburo Arasaka. The longtime head of the Japanese mega corporation was reported slain on the premises of the Konpeki Plaza corporate hotel while attending a family gathering. Saburo Arasaka's son, Yarinobu Arasaka, has cast blame for his father's murder on the company's rivals, although he has not yet provided evidence supporting his claim. According to market analysts, Where is it? There. I will take the bike.
first I will make a hard save and then I have a small break I will be right back I'm back and I, for now, I noticed something that actually was missing. Ta da! Don't put on Never click attack at the sense of those subs Well, well, well I'll rip out your spy Oh. Oh. 
this. Okay, we are not doing that yet, apparently. I need better weapons. I know where I'm gonna strike before I do it. Here for a fight. Which one of you's my guy? Me! Wasn't expecting a tag team, but whatever, I guess. So, who do I got first? No, no. You don't get it. That body and this one. I'm the same person. So, what? I'm seeing double? I used to be twins, which you could probably guess. The twins had a close bond. They wanted to be closer, stronger. So they installed neural oscillation sinks. And now they're, well, me. me. One, One person, person two, bodies. two bodies. My bodies do everything together. Everything. Whatever. Oh, and if another one of you pops up, I don't mind beating a third ass. You got a sharp tongue, no doubt about it. Let's see how that helps you when fists start flying. So, so can, can we, we get, get started? started? Show me what you got.
did it and you had enough like your brother or hungry for more that ain't my brother oh, that's me Jesus what's so hard to understand here your winnings Always the next fight. Stop talking to yourself. Hey, sure the Ripper didn't swap anything else out? Felt like I was fighting against four left hands. Fuck, Fuck you! <laughs> Listen, out of curiosity, you guys can read each other's thoughts. No, no. Same person, same person, same, same thoughts. thoughts. If that weren't the case, I'd be on schizoid meds. Incredible. Well, it's good to see you transition from circus ring to boxing ring. Give me a break. I did do nothing. Come to go buy some new clothes. I did do nothing. Isn't that Tiger Claw Inc? Since when do gangers sell threads? Since one of their bosses decided that they don't need tombs with fucked up spines. Got any nice threads for me? If thrift falls into your definition of nice, then sure. First element.
light pink snow boots. Yes, my colors, yes. Craft it, wait a minute.
I this. That was the impossible one. Fine, keep an eye out. For unknown reasons, the coordinates came through corrupted, so I'm unable to determine the precise location. Before we do this, uh, quick save. Slow down! Leave me be! Stop! Hello. V. I've managed to re-establish contact with the vehicle. Shock therapy works wonders sometimes. I'm sending a tow truck and a share of your fee. Yet only one of those is going to your credit account. Ha ha ha.
I actually need a better vehicle if I ever do Delaman missions. That is different cyber cycle, okay. Let's try that. I don't like pain. My whole life is pain. No, don't, no, 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 no. Okay. You know. I want you. Did it have on you? Did it have on you? My favorite program is on. Oh, never mind, it was the news.
We heard not such in some action. Got monst Maelstrammers holding ass out there. Go see what's going on exactly. What's this? Se ei voi olla. Oh, kid was a Valentino, not a Maristammer. Bog fiend. Bog fiends must have had an axe to clan with him, cause they stuffed with him in plus like a fucking Christmas turkey and just watched and waited for him to blow. Some bolt, hap Some bolt happened to anyone chip that fast, but he didn't have time to adjust to the wear and turned him psycho. Good thing he still had a little self-control left, meant I could take him down quietly.
What's this? Let's go check that one out. Approach the Delamain cab. What is? All of it. The city, the bustle, the crowds. 
It's overwhelming. Well, so let's get you back to safety. The garage. By driving. Through the streets. Well, uh, yeah. Afraid so. Fine. Take me there. Just get me out of here. Let me know when I'm safe. You're welcome in, but do take it slow. And try not to hit anything. This is just sad. Depressed AI. There's two possibilities that might happen when AI becomes very close to human level, human thinking. Either it becomes homicidal or very depressed. There is no between. Either homicidal or depressed. Either Skynet or that one android robot from Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. We're going to die. No, 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 no. You are not going to die. Just keep it together. Don't worry. wasn't so bad. It was horrifying. But still, I thank you. You're welcome. Hopefully you have a good rest Sincerous of the day. Thanks for your assistance, fee. I've taken the liberty to send you a share of your fee. Even the AI needs something. Actually, I have to say, this is good. Even if I have to press two buttons, it is still just menu, click. 
Quick saving. It's the quapo. Need for steam. Fuck you looking at? Nothing to see here. Move along. What's going on here? This your first day in Night City? What's it fucking look like? Get out of here, piss ant. Leave him alone. See this badge? That means I can do whatever the fuck I want. Ah! God, you got on it. Feel the deal. Ugh. Rise and shine, Corpo Swine. <coughs> oh, fuck. <coughs> <coughs> Shit. <coughs> well, if it wasn't for you, I'd be... Well, uh, thank you. Were you sent by the company? Wrong answer. Then, hold on. What do you want from me? Nothing. I... I don't... I don't believe you. You saved me just like that because you... felt like it? Don't measure others by your own yardstick, prick. I can't loot them! How loot? I can't break in because those are police vehicles. I don't know, I don't want to know what HDP means. Mm. Dino Dinovic. Intelligence.
πρόσεχε. Let's put one point there. Is done or done a week, geek. You don't got any real girls? We employ dancers here. No joy girls, no dolls. Uh, I hope this was a fun club. I could offer you a booth with a private dance or a hard BD. Excellent choices, both. I want the real deal, not some shitty virtue. Not so fast, little man. No weapons allowed. We're running a civilized operation. Where can I then? Welcome. Please go right ahead. See? Wasn't so hard. 
Welcome to empathy. Thank you. Don't let those pricks twist your arm. I won't. We must build our network. This was a fun club. I could offer you a booth with a private dam. Not so fast, little man. Excellent. No weapons allowed. We're running a civilized operation. See? Wasn't so hard. Welcome to empathy. Don't let those tricks twist your arm. Let's try this again. For a Don't man, get just... into. Yeah, this is, that is... Samuna, you say.
getting it on back there or what? I can play this. Why I sound surprised? It's that wasn't the exit. That was the emergency exit. Please go right ahead. Mama Wales. Anything interesting happening in the area? Interesting. Around here? <laughs> Not one single thing. That's why the kids, they join gangs. No jobs. No future. And where they end up? Behind bars, or in the ground. This neighborhood died a long time ago. How do you feel? I lost my son. How am I supposed to feel? I... I'm sorry, V. I shouldn't have... I... It's just... When I see him that day, in that limo, all covered in blood. Do you know what I wanted to say to him? Te metiste en una gran problema, Jackie Wells. I gotta go. Obvious? No. No, 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 no. What are you not doing? Masamune Power Assault Rifle Power Assault Rifle Power Submachine Gun
Charge the cause an angry blast when shot and inject full charge weapon. Yes. I will take that. Yeah, I think I am taking... And by the way, you're welcome to swim by any time. Clubs always open to you. If you... If you need a stiff drink, I let get the... Orgasm. Can't miss it. Let's go. Finally meet Takemuna. I am always keeping them... Trying to keep the main story moving. But still, I want to do what I want to do. So I apologize if my playstyle is always all over the place. I want that car. That car is me. But sadly, I can't take a picture of it.
Sit. Look at you do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Varasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You're thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Don't think so, no. Can you expand? Don't matter how much perfume McCorpo sprays on mornings. By lunch, that's replaced by the stench of skullduggery. Only thing I caught from Evelyn was determination. And I too stink of skullduggery? Nope. You're starting to stink. Period. <sighs> Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... B, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prep for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking 
Osaka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. You need to think about it. We'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree. I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make it like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. 
and I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Why should I trust you? Remind me again. Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogel danced any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Find Evelyn at Lizzie's bar. Call Judy. Optional. Me too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. You heard about the heist, I take it. Must have, uh, talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Old damn city's hurt. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What'd I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Hey, look. Huh. Interesting. Would you look at that? You see it too, right? Yeah. You got completely whacked, or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Eh, yeah, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask them both. The Zerit. And again, my brain just didn't that talk to Misty. Is asleep. Oh, yeah? When you get those kind of tunes? From way back. I saw a weird image out on the street. Uh, seems like your line of work. What'd it look like? 
I grabbed a scan. Take a look. Taro. Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. I said, the what now? Major Arcanum? Tarot card, archetype, knowledge held in symbolic form, a stage in your journey through life. Take your pick. Either way, you're saying some higher power is talking to me through tarot cards. Or to Silverhand. Or both of you, seeing as you form a harmonious whole at the moment. You know, it'd be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right. Great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand, from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road. So go down it. Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. I don't know. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. Got it. Talk to Victor. Why that kid has a gun? Hey, guess what? I don't talk to strangers. Mm hmm. Smart kid. Got a few questions about Silverhand and this chip. I'm no expert, but fire away. See what I can do. How is it even possible seeing him? Well, that biochip is designed for users to communicate with constructs. It's just doing its job. So I got our socket to thank. You know, I wager you have the lowest net worth of any relic owner out there. Tried to flatline me. Johnny did. What? What can I do to suppress him? You know, avoid my murder. Well, long as you don't give him control, can't do too much harm. Of course, that won't necessarily be possible after some time. And what then? What do you say we don't let things get that far? Find a way to get rid of Silverhand, and fast. Why am I reliving Johnny's memories? You two share a brain now. He has access to your senses, perceptions, even some memories. Likewise, you've got a glimpse into his. After a while, you won't even know whose is whose. Listen, don't laugh, uh, but I've been seeing some weird shit around town. Like, murals or something. But I know they're not real. Uh, just a Kuroshi blip. Could take a look. No, no. The images are too complex for a blip. It's like they're symbols. That case is the biochip. Brain can't handle the data overload. Either that, or it's reached the cortex. <sighs> Can you do anything? Nope. Better find a way to get rid of that chip. thinking about swapping some chrome. 
You got any new toys? Have a look. Do, 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 what I was thinking about legs. Double jump. Small poison I think this is the very stupidest thing I have ever done. Quick save, thank you. Excuse me. And I tell you, no! The Arasakas are no ordinary. They're not even human! Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> there was a limit! <laughs> 
<laughs> going to the middle. Uh -huh. It's a Phantom Liberty. Exclusive, okay. The Solos Manual by Malcolm Blackhead. Various popes. Tale to his clanson. Barry. I am actually worried about Barry. Atmos Collective. Guns, guns, guns. Who do I spy? A happy new gun owner, I hope. I am just thinking, did you have something? But I, I have equitable pledge to take. Make the weapon non lethal.
That actually is good if I... Hmm. Actually, it. I am thinking maybe this might be good to have. Non lethal. Because one weapon is good to have non lethal. I just <sighs> or can I just pick them? Okay, I need to take one weapon out. The iconic weapons, yes. He can't hear you. Your, your genes were fine, Barry. You were the strongest son of a bitch I knew. I'm so... I'm so sorry, Barry. I... I'm sorry.
Ja näitä on sitten... I was actually waiting for the worst end, but there was a small hope that it ends. Sell this. People, those. Why should I make plant weapons little? I have no idea. Let's see if there's anything else going on. Assault in progress. There is talent cut there. So, okay, let's do this. I am doing this cut talent card and then Stop for the day. I'm Jillian Jordan. Scientists from Biodyne Systems have announced a breakthrough in the fight against multiple sclerosis. MS is one of the few diseases that cannot be cured by replacing the affected tissue with implant technology. But the experts at Biodyne have created nanites that, when injected into the spinal cord, provide long term uninterrupted repair to the neural tissue. The cost of this cutting-edge therapy treatment has been listed at 700,000 euro dollars per month. For the second consecutive week, the landfill inferno in the remnants of Atlantic City continues to run. Everyone, including you and me. Each step he takes on his journey feels like stepping into a brave new world. Ultimately, the journey will change him, but as the card shows, he's a trustworthy lad whose tireless hope drives him toward his goal. And then next... Oh, 
By the way, let's go to our stash. Open stash. I'm just going to the street level. Then I will stop for today. I actually stayed in the elevator. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> um. What did I just say? Was how exactly? There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Kompiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. You sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Fine, where's the meat and when? Japan town, after sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. Okay. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. The sun at night from the den located of the fifth bamboo in the hamlet. The fox goes out to the hunt, he quenches his first at the bottom in the hole while waiting for your arrival. He takes shelter in the shade of the cherry blossoms. The fox is cautious, it surely emerges when it is sure that the water was not poisoned. Take a look. A motor milk, yes. 
This is the camera. I am using a burner via secure connection, but I figure it would be best to use the secret code I created. I expect that it might be beyond your capabilities. Ouch. Meet me at the docks and channel state Japan town. Come at night. If nobody has followed you, I will show myself. I trust this boss understood. Not too complicated. Got it, Colo. See you. And then... That was the end of this day's adventures in Night City. And I will get on to it next week. And there is nobody to hate, sadly. At least this view account. But thank you everybody for watching and see you again next time. Same Venot channel. Bye bye.